Hi, it's Bits from My Life Mints. Thank you so much for stopping by. Today is going to be a chatty video. It's not a journal with me video, but I did want to sit down and set up my pouch here. I made this super duper easy pouch. It even has a zipper on the top. And this is actually uh, some, pa some packaging of like these little strawberry candies. And I saw several of these like DIY videos um, on YouTube. So I decided to try it out and it looks really, really cute. I will most likely just end up making a charm or something uh, to make it even more <laughs> cute. But um, yeah, I just wanted to put some things in here and then I don't want to bulk it up too much, but I was hoping to be able to maybe stick it in here but the zipper is on this end so I might have to end up sticking it upside down but if it's flat enough if I don't st stuff it too much it actually closes quite nicely I'm just making sure that I'm in frame there so yeah I hope you don't mind this kind of I don't know what kind of video this is a setup I guess a setup of my pouch <laughs> I don't know um, but it's probably going to be quick. Um, I wanted to put some things in here because lately I've been stuffing things in here, which is fine. Um, I also stuff some things on the back and then see, as you can see here, I've been stuffing them on the pa in the pages here, but I feel like they're going to fall out. So I want to make sure that I have them all contained in here and, um, and then it kind of forces me in a way to use up all the items in here before I can refill it again, if that makes sense. So I thought I would do that with you on camera. Let's see if there's anything in here that I can... I could probably even stick the washi, but I want to leave these out so that I can... Did I mention this to you? This was made at uh, Uniqlo... Oh my gosh, I don't remember where. I remember driving there. It's a it was a bigger Uniqlo and uh, it was I think it was a weekend or something. Um, but they had this station for kids. They had like a reading area. It was that it was so cool. It's like a small little reading area with a whole bunch of uh, kids books and the kids were able to read books there while they waited for their parents. Um, and they had a station where you can make your own bookmarks. You can choose the different you know sequins and. Uh, different papers and things um, and if you purchased over a certain amount you have you receive this for free so my husband needed a pair of pants for work <laughs> and we were able to get this my my son said this is a gift for me so I want to stick this in here yeah I think I'll leave the washi cards in here instead of keeping them in here that way I will always see them. This one... I was able to use one sticker, but I'm still waiting for some special occasion that I can use that sticker. So these bits, I can put them in here. I thought I would put some of these ones inside. Not a lot, just some... A couple with a different, like, color. So this is pink and then this is like a, she's wearing a darker dress. So instead of choosing like these two, I would choose something like this so that I have a more of a variety. This one is beige. So let's stick with those three. And then from here, let's see what we can get. Let's do, this is different. And then this is blue. Oh, there's a brown. Let's do that. So there's these ones. Let's put them inside. I don't want to make this too full. I have a feeling this is going to be very full. Or what if I had these girls like standing up here? Oh, I'm not going to be able to see them. <laughs> uh, let's see. Oh, these pockets are quite... Look at, they're nice sized pockets. Maybe I'll have them all peeking out through here. <laughs> For now. 
And then if it doesn't seem like it's too bulky, then I'll stick these girls in back into the pouch. This morning my snack is this tuna corn onion and mayonnaise. This would probably taste a lot better if I toasted it, but um, my husband is working upstairs. He's on a meeting, so I'm down here in the workroom and I want to set this up and then I have to get back to work. So I don't have too much time, but I really want to eat this while I set this up. So I hope you don't mind. I really miss my edamame bread. I don't know if you remember me talking about it, the one with, there's like edamame inside. Uh, it's very, I really like the texture of the edamame. The, I don't know how you would explain it, like the crunch, not crunchiness of it, but you know what I mean? Like it has a bit, the beans, has a bit of, um, and then mommy is to it, if that makes sense. But I don't know if you can hear it in my nose, but the allergies are just so bad lately. My nose is always running, and then my eyes are starting to get itchy. I think because lately it's been very, very windy. I'm gonna stick all the photos together. Thank you all for your kind comments about the printable. I'm very, very happy that you enjoy using it. This is, I think I have this one left and then, um, but anyways, I'll post the link down below if you're interested in downloading it for free. If for some reason you cannot get it to work, just email me. My email address is down below and um, I'll send you the link, like I'll send you the file directly to the email. So I want to put all the photos together. Courtney Diaz. Oh yes, I have to show you these other ones too. This is from Sojourner from Rowena. She made a printable. Uh, this is from um, Kyla at Rainbow Holic and Julie. They I think they collaborated to make this one. This piece of paper. I think I had my snack on it. Um, in one of my videos, but I don't want to waste it. So Here it is and Beautiful artwork. I don't know how she does it, but she's always Sending me these beautiful like I don't know what these are card art artist cards art trading cards I think and um, They're so so pretty There's another one. I have So I didn't even mention her name. Her name is Katrin Katrin, uh, there's another one in here somewhere. Oh yeah, I put it in here. This one is really pretty too. And she always has these cool layers of, like this one has some text. She painted some leaves and cut these out and so neat. <clears throat> of course, I can't forget Job's journal as well has a, right here Job's journal, he has a free printable too. So I think I might, I'm gonna have to cut this cause this is not gonna fit. I don't even know how long this video is already. Maybe like, let me see, 10 minutes. It's over 10 minutes, so. Sometimes I sit down and do these kinds of things and I don't know if they're interesting, if I should put the camera on. I feel like because of the, many people are in lockdown, I feel like maybe these videos, although they might not be very, um, I don't know, I don't know, they, they might not be very informative, but I think sometimes it's nice to just have somebody journaling with you or doing a setup with you. Even if it's, like I said, it's not really informative or I'm not offering any like neat tips or anything like that. Not that my videos really offer any tips, but you know, I'm not doing any journaling. So um, I thought I would just stick the camera on and if you feel like watching, that's cool. If not, that's okay too. Um, I'm, I've been lately searching for these kinds of videos where the person is just sitting down and just working together, we're just working together or, or not necessarily journaling, but you know. Sakura is starting to come out, which is very, very, I'm very, very happy for that. Um, I'm not going to use them all, I think, uh, because I want to give these to some, like, I want to put these in some packages, so... 
I'll just take a couple and then leave the other ones. Same with this. I'm not going to... I think I already used this one in the Hobonichi earlier, so I'm going to put this back so that I can give this... Uh, I'm trying my best to put like little extras and things. So I'm not the only one that packages the orders, so uh, whenever I have the chance to, I would I always try and <laughs> add a little something extra. I think that's okay. I think that one will fit, right? Maybe I need to cut uh, this one here. Yeah, so if you don't mind these like non... I don't know what you call them. They're not really, they're not really educational or they're not really non-journal with me videos. Uh, please leave me a comment down below if you want me to continue with these kind of videos where I'm just sitting down and just working on something. I definitely want to use some of these because I always use these in my Hobonichi. But I think I will just use a couple and then the rest I will, like I said, put them in some orders. This is some packaging from Shake Shack. Oh, I really want to go back again one day. It was so good. I was telling my husband about it. <laughs> Oh yes, this is the chic sparrow. Oh, this is not going to fit. And I don't want to cut it up. So, um, let's put this in the bigger pile. These ones are for sure going to go inside the pouch. Let's see. Oh, right. I need to put this in a journal spread that I did. I remember I was journaling about seeing Mount Fuji. And then I saw the journal spread and realized I didn't even put a photo in there so uh, this past weekend we went we drove away from the crowds there's just it's disappointing how many people are still out and about in Tokyo people need to be away social distancing right and yeah my husband is like let's get away from the crowds it's not fair for the kids to always be cooped up indoors um, so let's get out and away from the Tokyo crowds and enjoy nature. So we were very thankful that the skies were blue and clear and the Mount Fuji was very, very pretty. Let me... Let's see here. I think it's... Nope. Is it here? There we go. So I'm going to tip this in somewhere. I don't want to cover this cute guy up. It's from Courtney. Maybe if I tip this on the bottom or if I stick some washi tape up here. Let's quickly do that. Uh, let's choose some washi tape that is not too colorful. I really like these like these ones here, these kind of washi tapes, where it's not like a solid color like this one. These ones are, you can kind of see through them. Not see through them, but they're translucent. So let's do that. Yeah, let's do that. And I'm going to see if I am skilled enough to do this on camera without getting my head in the way. Oh, it's a little thick. Oh, it should be okay, let's try it. Um, so maybe right about there. I always get so nervous when I'm on the camera and I don't know why I've been doing this for years now. Um, but it always, even when like doodling and drawing, there we go. <laughs> That's cute. Okay. Okay, so I think that's about it. I'm going to put this back in here because it's too big to fit in the pouch. I want to maybe tip it in somewhere. It just matches so nicely, like the huckleberry color. 
And then these ones I'm going to put in for sure. And so it's nice and flat. It's not like too much. This one's in here. I don't know if this is going to fit. Let's see. Oh, it's just perfect. Okay, great. And then these ones too should fit as well. Oh, maybe not. I don't know. We cut this down just a tad. Have you seen Rowena's recent video? I was watching it. Um, it was about her travel satchel, I think is what it's called. And the leather is very, very pretty. And it's so tempting to get it. But I don't know. Lately, I've been struggling so much with my style. Like, I don't have a style. I don't... Um, my style is, like, just throw on some clothes whatever is easy to move in because I have kids and I'm always running after them or we're always running around I don't know I just feel like I want to change things up and have my own identity as a mommy if that makes sense I just I'm really struggling with that right now really really struggling with that maybe if I should get like some fashion magazines or I don't know but I think I'm going to end up folding this because it's not fitting. But yeah, so I'm struggling with that, meaning I really don't know what I want to wear as a purse or a bag. I usually just carry a backpack so that I have all their, like, their drinks and snacks and uh, extra set of clothes and all that stuff. And lately I've been just wanting to kind of, I don't know, I'm just really struggling with my image, I guess. So this should be fine. What do you think? Oh, this is so cute. There uh, is like a, I think it's called uh, like a window film on top of this. So it's not really shiny. It's quite, it makes it a little bit matte. I don't know if you, if that picks up on camera, but. And then this zipper closure. So, so cute. And if I make like a charm, but then at the same time, if I put a charm that I can't really, well, Maybe if I make a charm, it'll hang out from here. I'm not sure. Maybe that'll be too much. I think that might hit the book and then it won't close properly. Or, let's see. It's so crazy because I rarely touch this side. And this side is so, like, it feels like the leather, uh, when I first received it, it's so, like, soft it feels really good oh I don't want to do that I don't want to ruin this one I don't want to ruin this part so I'm gonna do this and leave it upside down and so it should be okay it should still close oh yeah that's fine I took the elastic out um, I just wanted it to if I just wanted to use it like a folio style, I guess, I just wanted to be able to just open it and close it. But I might uh, put it back in now that I have this pouch. But yeah, that is it. I don't, I don't know, do you find these videos interesting? Um, yeah, do you want me to turn the camera on more? I don't know, for me, I find it so fun to just kind of sit down together and it doesn't really have to be a journal with me. It can just be me listening to somebody talk um, it's just really interesting I like I've been searching for videos lately because of the because uh, I'm staying home a lot more lately and just to have someone there chatting together in a way but yeah that's it I hope you enjoyed this video let me know down below if you want me to make more of these videos please stay positive and please stay safe and I will see you soon thank you so much bye bye